The United States, home to the world's most powerful air force, is where we can witness the aesthetically pleasing performance of the Textron Airland Scorpion aircraft. If you're unfamiliar with this name, don't worry, you're not alone, as the Textron Airland Scorpion's first flight was only on December 12, 2013. It's only been built in a limited amount, a mere four units, but few realize that this aircraft was initially envisioned to be the most affordable tactical jet in the world. Textron, the manufacturer, explains that the Scorpion is designed and built with composite materials for most of its fuselage and wings, enabling it to perform a multitude of tasks. As a product of the U.S., it's no surprise that Scorpion has incorporated electronic equipment that meets the standards of a modern aircraft, featuring a multifunction display, navigation system, and guidance system. The Scorpion is powered by two Honeywell TF-731 engines, producing over 3,600 kilograms of thrust per engine, with a maximum takeoff weight of nearly 10,000 kilograms and a service ceiling exceeding 13 kilometers. The design of the aircraft's wings, upon closer examination, reveals its remarkable top speed, which is difficult to surpass the 900 km per hour mark. However, the U.S.'s Scorpion aircraft boasts a truly exceptional operational range, reaching up to 4,500 km. Interestingly, the Scorpion can operate as a light reconnaissance aircraft, an attack aircraft, and can also serve as a trainer aircraft. All this comes at a price under $20 million, and its operating cost is a mere $3,000 per flight hour. This multi-role attack aircraft is marketed as exceptionally suitable for aerial patrol missions, such as asymmetric warfare, border patrol, maritime surveillance, emergency relief, counter-narcotics operations, and air defense. It's true. It's affordable, durable, multifunctional, and made in America. It's truly an extraordinary feat. Beyond the U.S. Air Force, the target customer for this Scorpion are foreign countries that lack the resources to acquire F-35s, but desire an aircraft that performs ISR and light attack tasks better than propeller-driven aircraft. Indeed, amidst the rising costs of fighter aircraft, akin to inflation, most countries are in dire need of specialized fighter aircraft to sustain their training, reconnaissance, and close combat operations. Therefore, if the Scorpion were to truly enter mass production, it would undoubtedly have a substantial opportunity to become a highly sensible choice. Reports indicate that the U.S. Air Force, back in 2015, had revealed the Scorpion, suggesting that if it passes a series of stringent requirements, it could potentially be used to replace the A-10 Thunderbolt II and F-16 Fighting Falcon units, both of which have aged considerably. However, no purchase agreements have been announced between the U.S. Air Force and Textron. Hence, the future of this distinctive aircraft remains uncertain. So, these concluding visuals of the Scorpion, a multi-role attack and trainer aircraft, are truly unique, serving as the finale to our video on the world's top training aircraft today. Which name impressed you the most? Leave your response below.